Hi, this is Jason Phillips, and I am working on Lab 4. Uh, I think it was the properties of gases. And right now, I've got all my stuff laid out here. Um, let me go back to the materials page. I've got my matches. I've got my... Well, I didn't have a regular toothpick, so I got a dinosaur toothpick. I'm just kidding. Um, let's see. Pi tin. I need to grab that. Hang on just a second. this all right okay let's see hydrogen per peroxide household vinegar Measuring spoons. Oh, darn it. Hang on. Okay, measuring spoons. Tissue paper right here. Drinking straw. Leaf. Okay, drinking straw, tissue paper, baking soda, check right here, safety goggles, and I've got the test tubes, my pack only came with four of them, but I'll, I'll make do with these, and then I've got them in, uh, I believe this is the well plate tray, it wasn't labeled, but it does say 24, and there are 24 slots there, so I assume that that's for holding these up. Um, let's see, the other pieces, got the pipettes I believe, the empty short stem, not sure exactly how that's going to go in there just yet. Um, rubber stopper, don't need that. I got my Alka-Seltzer, the blue stuff, uh, brom, bromthymol blue, and the little pipit, hydrochloric acid, lime water, magnesium metal pieces right here, check, a lot of stuff, magnesium metal pieces, pipit bulbs, I've got three of those, and my magnesium right here. So I'm ready to get going. So we're going to take the hydrogen, place a small piece of the zinc, mossy zinc, into the test tube containing the diluted HCl. Diluted HCl. Let's see. Did I miss something? Before beginning, set up a, into the test tube. Take a test tube and cap it with the rubber stopper. They didn't tell me how much of the HCL to put in there. 
These gases, several gases are produced frequently in the laboratory and it's important to be able to identify them by the physical chemical properties of the gases under investigation are hydrogen, H2, oxygen, and carbon dioxide. These gases will be generated using small scale techniques and carrying out the following reactions. Okay, I've got the hydrochloric acid in my test tube. And I've got the zinc here. I'm going to put that in there. Bubbles are coming up. That's neat. Well, I'm going to keep going. I'm going to do the, the mole blue next and uh, keep on going. Thank you.